Let's try that again. <laughs> Good morning, you guys. My mic was on. Hopefully it is now. Um, today's, what, what, is it a Wednesday? Today's a Wednesday, right? We, I actually, you guys, I can't remember the last time we ever launched on a Wednesday, but in true um, COVID world fashion, um, we're just going to launch to you whenever we can launch to you whenever we have a lot of product coming in. So I don't see anything. I see a big blank black screen. Um, is anyone there? I hope you see Sarah. Let me read the question. Okay. Hold on just one second. I want to see your comments. I actually, um, I, I like to interact with you and know someone's on the other side. So let's see really quick if she can get she can get that up but okay so here we are on our Wednesday if um, I know this is weird for a lot of you we have been Thursday and Friday launches for like as long as I can remember and every once in a while there's like a Tuesday but a Wednesday okay there you are yay Linda Fast is here hi from Colorado Pat from Virginia Roberta from Canada Renee from Southern California Christine okay here they all are Patricia's Patricia's here Grace and Lace says they can see <laughs> and they can see me um, Deborah from Tyler area. I lived in Tyler for years in Longview. I lived for, in that area, gosh, for five, six years. That's exciting. Um, okay, you guys, we're going to start. So, um, like I've said every time that we have thrown our plans, our launch plans, our product arrival assortment, um, plans out the window a long time ago, which is sad because we true, truly assort launches to be, um, you know, things like full outfits and um, to have like a variety of assortment of how we like style it on the model, things like that. So when product doesn't arrive according to schedule and there's weeks and weeks of delays at the ports um, and the chain of the supply and demand chain is just so messed up, um, we just flow with it here in Grace and Lace World. So we got, I don't know, several containers in. In the last couple of days, um, our warehouse team is literally scrambling. We have boxes that haven't even been moved into the warehouse yet. But um, I told you and I promised you that we would just launch to you whatever we could, whenever we could. Okay, so lots of t-shirts came in. These are all actually supposed to be on a couple launches ago, but they're in. We have hoodies. We have tiered mesh that I have on. We have fashion. In fact, I didn't know. I was struggling. I didn't know to wear this or this. I almost wore the dress. The dress is finally here. The fall dress that we have. Um, we had a bamboo piece arrive, which was a big, um, it was a, we didn't think any bamboo was coming. So bamboo is here. Okay, leggings, <laughs> leggings are here. I have leggings on. Um, here we go, okay? We're gonna rock and roll today because we have a lot to talk about. The first thing we are talking about is the Daydream hoodie. Sarah, did I lose that light up top? Oh, it suddenly got really dark. Okay. Um, man, you guys, when I think about what I want to live in or be in or be wearing at all times, it is something like this. Okay. I love pullovers. I love hoodies. I love just, I mean, you guys, I've, I've said a million times, I'm like a, a jean and tee girl to the core. So what I can take something that's like this easy pullover this is like my weekend go-to okay so this one we did in a tone on tone purple so we've heard your cries for like purples and sages in your color cries um on our vip page so our team is making sure we kind of hit those with those of you that are purple lover lovers so this is a good dusty it's not super strong it's not super bold but the tie-dye on it is um is pretty subtle like it doesn't because it's tone on tone purple okay this is a looped what do we call it a loop back um so it's not fleecy but it's super stretchy and very like slinky heavy nice like drapey weight soft okay i'm going to show you a couple of things about this we wanted to give you the ability to wear this like if i you know well i do have like <laughs> leggings on um to just throw this on, okay? Just throw it on, whatever. Throw it on with a pair of leggings, the weekend or whatever, super casual, going out, whatever. I mean, it's, it's really just easy to wear. But we wanted to kind of give you the ability to fit with the trend of being able to cinch this up and sit on your hips. So 
all of the closures, so the arm opening, the sleeve opening, the bottom hem opening, have these kind of just kind of sporty um, little drawstring closures, okay? So what this allows you to do is if you wanna scrunch up this material on the sleeve, you can scrunch it to where you want it and just kind of pull this stopper. Now, keep in mind, if you don't want this, I'm gonna show you that these are super easy to remove, okay? So if you wanted to keep this just scrunched up like here, I would just scrunch it and then keep it here. Okay, now, if you're like, Mel, I don't really know, I just like my sleeves long, I don't wanna mess with scrunching them up, you can easily cut this off, okay? Or even tie it off. If you want to keep a little bit of a, like a spandexy closure on it, you can, Keep a loop where it is, use it as its function, or you could tie this off, cut this, and then it will just retract back to wherever, you, whatever tension you tie it off as into this channel. You see how there's like a little channel? So if that's something that you didn't want and you didn't want to use and you're like, I just love the simplicity of the pullover, I don't want the multi-use function, fine. Either keep it, put it where you want it. <laughs> <laughs> and cut it off or not and cut it off or you can just cut it out completely okay same with the waistline on this I love the versatility you're gonna see the girls come out in a second to have this long just fall down over your hips long over leggings or if you wanted to style this with jeans or you kind of like that cropped sweatshirt trend you can cinch this to your waistline okay and then it gives you which I think we show on the picture online with the model it gives you that blue sant look wherever you want it. So if you want it to hit at waist or hip level and just kind of fall, give yourself that cinch in the waistband with a little stopper, and it can be it can be more you know shorter or a little bit more cropped. And again, you guys, if you're like you're telling me like I just love it the way that it is, I know that's gonna feel good on my body. I don't need that stuff. You and you if you don't want it or you have little kids and you feel like they're gonna pull it or whatever or a cat or a dog. Um, you can easily just cut this off and let this just retract back in and you would never know that it's there or it can be a permanent stopped at that location by you just nodding this off and tying this then it will track back to wherever you um, want to keep that or like I said I love the versatility mm -hmm. just letting it kind of lay, lay out hang and then give the versatility being long or short okay okay does that make sense I wanted to explain because I didn't want you to feel like I want you to feel like you can truly customize this for yourself and how you wear it and how you prefer it to be. Or you can, if you love the versatility of being up or down or short or long, then use it, okay? Okay, let's bring out, uh, who's in this? Gabby's in this. Gabby's in extra, extra small. Did we make this an extra, extra small? Yes. Okay, you're an extra, extra small. Okay, so here's what I'm kind of, this is what I'm kind of saying. She's got all of hers let out, okay? She just took, we just took it out of the package, threw it on her, okay? So this is what you're gonna look like, where it would just, it's just gonna hang, but if she was like, you know what? I'm hot, it's still 100 degrees in here. She can cinch this up, and then, you know, that's gonna stay wherever she puts that, wherever spot she puts that, okay? So same thing on the waist. If she were to want to, she's got leggings on, so that's why I said I would just throw this on with leggings like she has it. But if she were to want to bring that up to hip level, like if we have jeans on, maybe someone will come up with jeans on and I can kind of show that a little bit better. But she can control where, do you mind if I do this? Oh, yeah, go for <laughs> it. <laughs> okay, so she's gonna, I'm going to cinch that in. Okay, you can tuck it under. And then see how that just kind of sits. And then you have still have this kanga pocket, okay? So you can, well, here. <laughs> I cinched her up on one and not the other. So you kind of have, you have control to have that casual, sit at your hip or waist or be a little bit longer and cover your bottom, whichever you prefer, you control it, okay? You get to choose how you prefer to wear that. That is extra, extra small on her. Okay, oh, thanks, Debbie. Um, Marie, I'm so sorry, not today. I wish they were today, they're not today. Okay, next is um, Natalie, okay? Natalie's in her normal size large, okay? So here we're gonna show you a couple different ways. So you can super athleisure this out. You can just throw it on with a pair of leggings and it can be your simple, just go through, go throw it on, whatever. Or this is another, so this helps me with my jean and tee, okay? Where my go-to is the jean and tee look is just throw on a pair of cuff jeans, throw this on and that's it, okay?
okay? You have an easy outfit, easy to wear. It's nice and stretchy. It has, did you cinch it all? Or So she did cinch it, so she cinched it. So she's up here, that waistband is sitting at her waist, and then she just allowed that to come down and kind of loose on over to wherever she wants it. She could go higher, lower, let it out completely. All your preference, you get to choose, okay? Normal size, large in that. Um, and then Michelle's in this one. Okay, and her, so same thing here. You guys, this is such an easy go-to for me. This is exactly how I'd wear this, okay? You don't have to think about it, but this purple is fabulous and it feels good and stretchy on the body. So she's in her normal size as well. Did you cinch yourself at all? A little bit, a little bit, okay. So she just pulled it out where you want it. And again, you guys, if you don't want that, I think it looks kind of has that sporty look. You can always tuck it in. Like she could just go like that, okay? Or you could know, like if I'm always gonna keep it here, this is where I always want it, you could tie that off with a knot and it would totally retract back into the channel, so. Okay. Oh, thanks Ivy, <laughs> thanks. Um, okay, let's move on. Oh, I get to, someone just said that, someone, I saw someone comment. Oh, Sean Marie commented about the tear mesh. Um, Tear mesh tank is back, that's what we're moving on to next. Do I have, yes. Okay, so we brought, I am wearing the cheetah. Is that cheetah? Yes. Or is it? Yeah. I don't know, you guys, leopard, cheetah. This is, we're just cheetah, cheetah or leopard, whatever it is. But either way, it's a nice, subtle, tone on tone. Okay, lots of creamies through here. This is like a cream mesh underlay. And then you have black, um, kind of like, like a faded, Kind of this this is a really really good i actually love how this turned out it's just kind of like a little bit muted cheetah um pattern and throw it on with denim jacket throw it on with her leather jacket i have it on the leather leggings which we're going to talk about in a second and then black restocked in this one now i think we've had a couple of different fits in these we're trying to get you more consistent fit i know we've had some in the past hold on a second i'll show you I'm in the size small, which is what I prefer in this style. The armhole is perfect, okay? Not too tight, not too loose, not too low, okay? We've really worked hard to get this to be a really good fit at the bust. And then you have kind of that swingy, just flowy waistline um, down at the bottom. So in the past, we've had the ability to size down in these where they ran really big. We have corrected that as of last year when we did like the green floral, um, gosh, I'm trying to think of what styles we did, we did most recently, but they have a better, more improved fit through the bust and then that kind of just drops swingy waistline. If you do not have a tiered mesh, now is the time to get one because everyone needs a black in their closet. Okay, the black is real solid. Solid black has the black mesh at the bottom, but it's the softest and stretchiest most comfortable thing. If I'm going to dress up for, for anything for any reason, I usually grab one of these. I grab them for under kimonos. I grab them from under denim jackets, the leather jackets, um, cardigans. These are great for the workplace. And then it's the high low. So you get a little bit higher in the front, lower in the back, which is perfect for covering for leggings, just like this. Okay. Um, Marie, I would do a small. She said, if I'm a four, six, do I do an extra small or small? I'm a six. Um, and this is the small, I would, I would, I would not go down to an, I could not go down to an extra small in this style, okay? Okay, um, so two colors, the black is restocked, but black, both of these have an improved fit, fit from um, the black that we've listed or that we've sold before. I think this one, if I remember, used to run really tight and small and I might have even sized up in it. It does it now, it has, it just has like the perfect, easy, more true fit and it's not not tight okay oh Carolyn yes there is a hoodie oh my gosh I talked about the hoodie but we didn't even there is a hoodie on the hoodie <laughs> so yes this can pull up on your head it has little drawstrings nice easy drop neck here um, just really casual and again you guys it's not a super heavy sorry I'm jumping around this is not a super heavy weighted um like fleeced material okay not super warm it's a per perfect transitional weight it's not jersey it is looped so it has a little bit of the fuzz behind it um but it has a really good weight like it's a very very high quality material you'll love this on your body okay can we uh, oh i gotta bring tiered mesh sophia's in this 
Can I even small or extra small? Extra small. Okay. I have no bust. <laughs> so, Sophia is more narrow, definitely more narrow through the chest, bust, waist. Her waist is like this big, okay, <laughs> than me. So she's going, she likes the extra small in these and has always liked to size smaller than me in these. So because she's more narrow through the chest and waist. So that's her normal size, extra small in that. Um, Natalie's in this one. What? Oh, you're in your normal size large, right? Okay. So here you can see, throw it on with a cardigan, a denim jacket, a leather jacket. We have lots more layers coming, you guys, okay? But these are so easy to transition into cooler weather because they can be worn year round. Obviously, the hot, the summer, spring, or whatever, don't have anything over it. And then as we transition, if you have, oh, if you have the black lace kimono, that would look fabulous with this too. But it's a good transitional piece that can easily just be your round piece. So her normal size in that. And then Amanda's in this one. <clears throat> Sorry. Debbie says, are there any leather-like leggings left? There should be. They're launched today. They should be on the site. <laughs> Double check that. Okay. And Amanda in her normal size extra large. Okay, so you can see. It doesn't have to be dressed up. You don't have to do the black with it. I think this is classic, classy, and can easily be that way, but you can do um, denim jeans. You could even do ripped with this and it would look very nice as well, okay? Nina says, um, Amy, all of these items are on our website at graceandlace.com. If you click on the new tab, um, they're all underneath. They're just releasing today. Nina says, is anyone having issues checking out? Um, tech team, if, or if you can, Email support at graceandlace.com. They can help you with that. Okay. Laura, these do run smaller than versions of tiered mesh that we have released in the past. We had spring versions with like Orchid. Oh, uh, we've done so many. <laughs> we've done so many of these in the past. The first rounds were very oversized. Remember? Like they hung really low <coughs> in the armpit. They, um, I could size down easily to the extra small in those. We've corrected the sizing since that. So for the last two years of designs of this, um, they, we've made them more true to size. I can no longer wear extra smalls like I could in the first rounds <clears throat> of tiered meshes that we released. I mean, are, we, are we talking like three years ago? No, I don't know. Long time ago in the spring, okay? So we, they were definitely more oversized in the beginning. We have made them more true to size. So this is true to size small and I cannot do an extra small in these, okay? Laura, yes. So. Um, the white and orchid from that year were were, ba were pretty much one size bigger than these. Yes. Okay. All right. Can we go on? Where are we at? Oh, Milana floral dress. Uh, you guys, we historically over the last couple of years, maybe just two years, have done a statement dress each fall. And I... I really remember the dang green dress, <laughs> we still call it that, that embroidered dress, which was gorgeous and very late coming in last year. I really didn't think we could hit a home run after that one. That was definitely a home run. And this one um, is probably, oh, can I say? I think I can say it's one of my favorite dresses to date only because it is so, not only, but it is so, so flattering on the body. And I'm gonna show you what makes this so flattering. One. Our custom floral plants, you guys, me, my team, my design team makes the best florals in the world. Like I cannot even ever find a floral that I have ever liked more than the ones that they custom make. So this is all custom artwork, custom rich colors. You guys know I like my florals to look like they're in season, right? I, I like to look like the look, you start getting deeper and richer into the season. And so oh, talk about home run in this color. We're on a dark navy ground but you have rich purples through here little bit of rust okay that brings in that fall by little pops of golden hue of yellow sage running all through here a little bit of ivory um uh, it is breathtaking okay the floral and the color is breathtaking but i want to show you what makes this dress it kind of has a couple of different options on a way to wear and really to show you how this um this can be styled, okay? So the top is, this is all of a pieced material. This gives a really flattering line down through the bust and this is all sheared. I don't know if you can see this, but I'm gonna tell you how 
beautiful it looks on the body, okay? At shoulder and even down through the back, this is a pieced, okay? So it has seaming that runs like this. It's just super flattering, gives you a really flattering fit through the chest and down through the sleeve as well, okay? So I'm not sure if you can see that well, but that's what really flatters this on the body. This is about a three quarter length sleeve maybe a little bit longer than that. It does not have elastic or anything tight here at the opening. It's just meant to kind of flow and fall. You guys saw this dress on me. I wore it to a wedding by accident. <laughs> was not planning to wear it to the wedding um, rehearsal dinner, but I had a dress malfunction or whatever. I had to wear it. You saw it in a different sample print, but this is the same dress that I wore and I absolutely loved it and I got a million compliments on it, okay? So that's what the bodice does. Now, coming down through the waistline, it is shaped down through the waist and then it has these large godet. Let me see if I can pull this out, okay? It has a lot of body in the skirt. We did this on purpose. We wanted to really give you that flattering shape through the waist and just allow it to fall with a lot of roughly falling, okay? Not sheared. It's a go, they're godet pieces and you can't see them because of the floral pattern, but they allow this skirt to really create just a beautiful cascading, almost like what like this tiered mesh is doing. See how this just kind of falls? That's what this skirt is gonna do at the bottom. Okay, there is an optional belt. I love, you can, you can do a couple of things with this, which I wish I had this on so I could show you how to wear this a couple of different ways. It does have a keyhole opening in the back. I would say it falls, I wear a size small, you guys saw the picture of me. It falls just beyond, like not at the top of my knee, maybe just right at my knee at 5'5". Five five. Um, so you create the waist, there is waist shaping, you can create more waist obviously by tying with the optional belt. What you can do and how I wore this at the wedding um, and how I love to wear it is I tie the waist. I wish I could, I wish I could put this on. <laughs> I tie the waist and then I blue sant the material. Okay, the top out of the tied waist a little bit. What that does is picks up the skirt a little bit, creates even more movement in the skirt and just gives a little bit more of that boho, a little bit more of that modern twist on a dress. You do not have to do that. It looks perfectly great, just hanging from your body, tied at the waist, okay? Very flattering that way. I just gave myself, by boussonning and picking up that skirt, you get even more movement out of those godets um, that allow you a lot of swing at the hip, at the, the waist, or the, the hip and the bottom, which I really, really love. So, no, Angie, it is not small in the waist. You still will create shape you still will help create shape with your tie. It's not fitted through the waist, but the, the way the godets hit allow this to have like a really pretty nice bodice and then fall and float the bottom. Let me stop talking and <laughs> bring some people out. It might be easier to see on them than me talking about it, okay? But no, it's not, <coughs> excuse me. It's not fitted at the waist, but it does have and allow for that waist shaping for gathering in for those of you who want um, that shaping at the waist and using that belt. I use the belt. I just choose to blue sonnet out from the top of the belt and pick up that skirt a little bit more. Okay. Okay. Oh shoot. I went out of order. Ah! Yeah, it was okay. we Sorry that. girls. Okay. Sophia is in the small on this. I, Sophia, could you do the extra small on this? Um, because I'm five, seven, I don't know if I would because of length. Oh, but if I was okay. shorter, then I could definitely do the extra. Okay. Small. So she's staying with a small in this. There's not, um, I don't know. Holly might say no. Melissa, don't say that. I was going to say there's not a ton of fit in this um, because it's not a set in sleeve. It's not a set in. Hmm. I don't know. I might get in trouble. I might get in trouble over in that right. But what it does is probably gives some of you the ability to wear a couple of different sizes in this because it's not fitted. Here, we're going to show you a little bit. Okay. So she, can you guys see? She has her waist. She has it like I, I explained the first way. She just put it on. That's it. Tied and tied the belt. Okay. So she's not blue sonning it out over the top of the belt. Like I talked about getting fancy and doing that. Okay. Um, so she just tied it. It's not, not snug on her anywhere. It's not cinched in at the waist anywhere, but she's creating her own cinching by tying at the waist. Okay. And then the skirt, you'll see it doesn't poof. If you want it to poof, you're going to have to do pull it out. Like I talked about. Okay. 
Oh, good. Don't do that. Yeah. Thing. It's going to pick up in your height, so that's where she probably can go down. Yeah. But then she's going to get more movement, even more movement in the bottom of this, which I think is just really fun and kind of has that boho feel to it, okay? You don't have to do that. I'm just letting you know there's an option for the way to wear it, okay? So small in this, she wouldn't, because she's taller, she's not going to go down to an extra small. Um, but you can see the pretty seam. Oh, I don't know if you can see the seaming is very pretty and very, very flattering at the arm, okay? At the bust. Okay, Laura, I would say it is true to size. Um, I would say it is true to size. Yes. If you're between, you can probably size down. Um, it doesn't have, it kind of just has a, it, it doesn't have a whole lot that's a true fit. If you're busty, you're, you'd want to be careful about sizing down and things like that but you've got a lot of room. Like it really just pretty flows as you walk and has a lot of movement with it. Okay, let me, Natalie's in this. Her size large, beautiful. Oh my gosh. I knew she was gonna look good in this and I was so right. Can you see how, oh, I feel like they can't see all that well because it's dark. It is so flattering down through the bust. Okay, that seam work with the shearing just adds really pretty shaping through her bust. And then so she just, you know, tied it it's not tight at the waist you can kind of see it's just kind of flowy falls and hangs and drapes this is her normal size large which is her normal size that she always wears okay so just falls and hangs has lots of movement again if you wanted to create that look of blousoning she could tie that tighter and blouson that up she would lose length though because you're pulling it up and then she would gain more skirt through the go days in that okay isn't that so pretty yes amber is navy it's um navy ground yes Okay, okay, I know, you guys, it's so flattering. All right, Amanda's just gonna come, because I know she loves this on her too, okay? That is what, when we fit this thing, I was like, you guys, this fit, Holly worked her tail off on the fit on this, and it came out even better than I can imagine, because it's it looks so, so dang flattering on everyone, okay? Bust, no bust, curves, no curves. Like, it's just easy, flows, fits, moves. Just throw it on and just tie your, tie your belt. You didn't have loose on yourself, did you? I oh. didn't. No. I okay. can. I was okay. playing with it either way. Off. Yeah. So she just, she, again, just just fell, tied it where she wanted, and it's easy. Okay? Um, you guys, any other questions on that? I would I would say everyone here stayed in their normal size, including Sophia. Sophia can sometimes go down to extra small. She didn't um, because of her height. But if height is not a thing for you, in your between sizes, you could probably size down. But I'm telling you, a lot of this is hard to see. The seaming work through here, this is a very complicated style for us, but the, se the seaming work through here um, and the go days in the skirt really make this stunning. So, wet wedding, I wore it to, <laughs> I wore it to a wedding, um, rehearsal dinner, I mean, any, any event. And the awesome thing is, you guys, is it's not super fall toned, like it works for transitional but this can easily go into other seasons as well. Okay. Dixie said, how does it look without the belt? Um, you don't have to use the belt because there is waist um, shaping, but it would depend on, you know, it just depends on personally how narrow your waist is. If you prefer to accent that or don't, I, I don't have, I'm pretty square. I don't have much waist shaping at all yet until I lose this. Um, so I like, you know, I, I like using the shaping at the waist just to create a little bit more flattering, but I do like to pull it out too. I think that just gives it a little bit more modem, modem thing. Yes, Jennifer, this necklace is ours, our design, and it's coming. We shot it with everything at the shoot because it's, it is fabulous. Okay, it is coming. Um, Terry, I would say she can wear, I think she can wear, Ashley can wear the small, it's probably a little fitted through her bust. Um, probably a medium would be a little bit more relaxed. So if you're not busty, stay. If you're busty, be careful about sizing down. Um, if you're busty in between sizes, be careful about sizing down. Okay. Okay. Can we move on? Um, Arabelle, this is another two gorgeous floral um, fashion styles coming. I said it last time, and I still stand by it with this. Uh, we just knock it out of the ballpark on our florals. So this one is on a deep teal ground, and then you get a little bit more of a busier pattern here, but we still brought in kind of these purples, little touch of pops, yellows, rust, kind of working with that similar color pal palette. Very different, very different, um, but still working with those tones into the jewel tones, which we love so much. 
um, in the fall. Cindy, yes, you could tie the dress in the back. Absolutely, you can. That's an optional tie. You can tie it wherever you want it. Okay. Um, and then, okay, what we did with this, so this is a great, those of you who are like, I'm back at the workplace, I need more work stuff, we're trying to bring back our work line. I spent a bazillion dollars on our work line right before COVID. Um, that has cost us a lot, a lot of money, loss of a lot of money. So I've been a little bit scared to bring it back, but we have pieces like this that work, that we did, that you can absolutely work as, wear as work wear or not, okay? So something like this is, is perfect for that. This is smocked up here, okay? Gently smocked, it's not too tight, not forced. This has a gorgeous sleeve. I love that we added a big panel of smocking down at the wrist. Um, I just think it sits pretty, it lays pretty um, on the forearm. There, it's not too tight, it's not too snug, like it's, it's a comfortable, but visually it looks really good for smocking. And then a little bit of a ruffle sleeve coming off here at the shoulder. Um, and then this one has the keyhole um, opening in the back as well. Oh shoot, they're asking, can Gabby come out in the dress? <laughs> they're probably all changed the next thing. You guys, if you want to see someone that we didn't show, you can ask that on our VIP page and the girls might be able to throw it on, but I'm sure they're all changed into this, ready to come out in a second. I would say this runs, is she like, I got that on video. Oh, she got on video. <laughs> She's like, no, don't make her change. She's ready to come out. Um, okay, runs true to size. I would not size down in this one. We'll bring them out in a second. Um, this is just a classic true to size fit, um, very flattering at the chest and the neckline, nice sleeve. Like I said, let's, let me stop talking. Okay. <laughs> Who's, we backtrack. Oh yeah, Gabby's in this. She's an extra small, um, which I think is the smallest size. I don't think we did this one in extra, extra small because it runs pretty true to size. Okay. She is work wearing it up. See, they hear me back there. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. They're styled like this. So she is showing you what can be done. You can tuck it all the way in. Did you belt? No belt. I did okay. not belt. No, did not, not need to. Um, and then this is a great work. She's got a pair of work shoes on. She's got our fat fit work pants. And look at how pretty. Okay, so the wrist, you get a little bit of that smocking. Nice, pretty detail up at the chest. Little bit of the flutter off the shoulder. And that is her, um, she's extra small in this one. Okay. Hi, Jane. Uh, welcome. You don't need to sign up to purchase anything. Just go to graceandlace.com. These are all new releases that we're showing um, on our lovely staff members. And you can purchase them from our website. They are our designs that just re released today. Okay. Um, okay. Natalie. I have that. I, I went backwards. Okay. <laughs> Natalie. Natalie's in this. Um, I'm screwing myself up by looking where, where I thought I should be on the list. Um, her normal size large in this. So, you don't have to style it for work. You just saw Gabby in that, but you can easily do a pair of darker washed jeans. Um, you can go classy with a boot, uh, booty with this. You can wear it for a date night, girls night out, some event or occasion, or like I said, easy for work wear too, okay? So her normal size, large in that. And then Amanda's in this one in her normal size, extra large, right? Yes. Okay. <clears throat> making sure I'm on track. We have so much to talk about. I feel like I'm talking. I'm talking so much. <clears throat> okay. Put a necklace with it. Dress it down a little bit. Don't be afraid. You can do distressed jeans with this. You don't have to dress it up. It can easily just be a fall fashion top for, like I said, going out to dinner, out with the girls. <clears throat> I don't know. I can think of a million ways that you can easily, easily wear that. Okay. Okay. Any questions on that one? Um... I'm moving into t-shirt world, <laughs> right? Is this right? I don't even know where to start. Where am I starting? Long sleeve, perfect pocket tee, which is one, two, three, four. Yes, is that right? Okay. Our long sleeve pocket tees, our pocket tees are one of our best selling items um, ever, okay? Besides boot socks and boot cuffs. Um, and you guys constantly ask for more of them, so here you go. They're finally all here. They were all supposed to be here a couple weeks ago. But we did a pretty um, red on red, what do we call this color? Wine, Wine stripe, okay. This is two shades of like a pretty red wine. The ground is obviously more um, of like a, you know, raspberry towards red, and then this is like a deeper wine color. Um, heads up, just, just know that this works with a lot of things. A lot of scarves that you already have in your closet, a lot of pocket ponchos you already have in your closet. 
a lot of layering pieces still to come. Um, if you like to layer, like layer your plaids with stripes, which I love to do, this is a standard one in a nice fashion color um, that works with all the things that you already have for us, okay? And then black with uh, white with black stripes. This is a mini, more of a mini stripe pattern. Again, you guys under vests, under jackets, under pocket ponchos with scarves, I think all those things. These are really, really good, just basic standard stripes. You might have a wide, the wide, the big wide stripe black and white that we did for years. This is more of a mini stripe, um, which is just perfect for those things. That one, am I supposed to bring people out in this? Let me just talk about all the colors. New oatmeal, perf the perfect oatmeal. Okay, all kinds of creams several different shades of creams and neutrals through here with a little bit of gray in there just to make that oatmeal color, okay? And then charcoal gray um, is back, which I think is just a realistic color. These are absolute basics in your closet. Now, keep in mind, you guys, if you don't have any of our long sleeve perfect pocket tees, these run more true to size than our short sleeve because they have a set in sleeve, they have a slim sleeve on them, so a small, um, in these looks different on me than the small in the um, short sleeve is much more oversized than that so keep that in mind do I bring people out in this yes. Gabby's in this okay real quick I'm trying to cruise I'm trying to cruise through tees <laughs> um, she's an extra small right okay jeans easy tuck she um, it does have a long sleeve. She's just showing you how easy this is to wear and wear um, with a jacket, okay? So same fit as our long sleeve Perfect Pocket Tees. You guys should know what size you are in those. If you're not and you're new to our brand, ordering your true to size in this, I wouldn't size down in this style yet unless you know that you're slimmer through um, the sleeve, okay? Okay, um, and the Michelle's in this in her normal size extra large. Will that charcoal stripe launch? This week. Um, Tony, I'm not sure exactly which one you're talking about. Here is on Michelle the wine stripe color, which um, you guys, this is really just a perfect kind of shade of that kind of raspberry, not not bright, not red, more to the blue side of red, and then the subtle stripe behind this. And like I said, you'll find every you'll find so many scarves in your closet that you already have that would go with that. Okay, her normal size, extra large in that. Um, where are we at? Perfect V-neck tee. Olive, oh, you guys have been asking for Olive to come back. I, this is a standard in my closet. I've been wearing Olive in the Perfect Pocket tee for, gosh, probably five, five years or longer. It's my favorite thing to wear under, what do I wear it under all the time? I always wear it under the favorite plaid, the black and white favorite, favorite plaid. I love the shade of Olive. It's not too green. Um, <clears throat> perfect shade it's in the perfect v-neck tee not the perfect pocket tee now so that's the difference I have I think the pocket tee from five years ago or longer than that um that is back it's the same olive color though from five years ago <laughs> same one I wear um no, no. <laughs> she got me before I started perfect sorry perfect v-neck tee Gray on gray stripe. This is another one that's a perfect neutral that you might not, you probably don't have in your closet. If you've already got the white stripes, be sure to grab this one. This is a more kind of dressed down neutral, perfect to throw on with loggers. Um, if you have any of the camel loggers, I think we shot it like that. This is just two tones of gray. Um, so we have the heather gray in here and then we have like a darker solid gray line, okay? This one's a standard. I grabbed this one, in fact, it's on my model rack right there because we grab this one all the time um great basic and then our home run floral again fall florals are what i love this one is on a dark wine ground but we have pops of teal through here pops of like a neutral i don't know kind of taupey tan color a little bit of orange through here this is our fall all fashion tee of the year okay in the perfect v-neck body no pocket on this one which runs more to, more true to size than a perfect pocket tee all of these do okay um but they run the same if you oh, do i have people oh i have yes. people sophia yeah. natalie are you guys in yes. okay <clears throat> just like super casual okay this is, what I said. this is what i grabbed 
Okay, Gina T girl, but she's doing it with leggings. With leggings, we're gonna talk about in a second. Um, I love this one. This is my next. <coughs> excuse me. Next new favorite. I need to drink a water. We are in your normal size, extra small on this. Uh, I think so. Yeah. <laughs> Look at yes. what size she's in. <laughs> yes, extra small. Normal, extra small. I wear a small in this. I can't wear the extra small in these. Um, I wear a small in this. I can wear the extra small in the perfect pocket tees, which are more oversized. Okay. And then Natalie's in this one, perfect V-neck tee. She's got the floor on. In her, do you go medium in these or do you go large? Large, large in these. Okay, so she can probably size down to the medium in the perfect pocket tees. Mm -hmm. She stays in her large in her um, perfect V-neck tees, which are a little bit more true to size. There's that pretty floral, a little bit of a drop necklace, which you should put it on with the, um, the little duster, the flip cardi, which is really cute. You guys, this is another floral that you will find so many things in your closet that work with pulling out colors in here, okay? And where am I at? I brought everyone out so far. Salt and pepper, long sleeve. long sleeve. Last week, they sent us half our shipment. Didn't we launch the short sleeve last week? Um, they finally unloaded the rest of the truck uh, or on the boat and got us the long sleeve version in this. So we make this color, this is that salt and pepper, nice kind of casually, casual, um, I don't know what what do we call that it's like heathering but it's more heathering than uh, melange yeah it's more than this can you kind of see that it makes it kind of just have like a good pop of that salt and pepper coming out in that and this is our neckline our newest version of that kind of scoop classic scoop classics classic I don't know what we call it, neckline that's not super scooped um, and it, but it's not as high as the classic it's a very very nice neckline so this comes in short sleeve and now in the long sleeve. And <clears throat> I have like a frog in my throat. Hold on, I'm getting water. <clears throat> okay, is that it? Gabby's. Yeah, oh, Gabby's in this. Right? Scooping up. Yes, I am. Yes, <laughs> okay. Okay, and she's, um, are you extra, extra small or? Mm -hmm. Extra, extra small. Extra, extra small. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> like her size. And what she is in this one. So you still get the flowy. What's great about our tees, our perfect pocket tee, V-neck tee line is these are super stretchy, have a lot of movement, very, very soft. And we give them um, a little bit of swing and length at the waist. So you can wear them long, cover with leggings, or you can tuck or knot them, which looks great too. Okay. Um, what did I miss? Realist. No, leggings aren't on my list. The perfect pocket oh. tee charcoal. Oh. Right. Wait. Hold on. I have another page. No, they're not even on. No, they're on. Oh, they're on here. They're on here. Yeah. Hold them down. I almost missed that. I almost closed. I almost just closed it up. Um, we're not closing it up. Um, the Grandpa Cardi. Uh, this. That's our internal name. What? Do, what is this pocket? Bamboo button. Bamboo button. <laughs> Cardi. We just call it Grandpa Cardi. VIPs. You probably call it Grandpa Cardi too. Um, this is our best-selling bamboo piece, and it is the only color returning in this style. So if you've missed the navy that we released last year and you wish you wouldn't have missed it, now is the time to grab it. It's also kind of the phasing out of, not phasing out, but we did not make new colors in this love style. I know that's sad, but we have other bamboo um, pieces coming this year, but these have these giant giant wood buttons nice big wonderful pockets that kind of just flop open this style um is this my size this is my size this style has a great sleeve on it it's not too tight you don't need some sometimes bamboo can be tight in the sleeves this one these are not okay nice long oh my gosh there is nothing you guys nothing like bamboo okay nice long sleeve on this you can fold it up if um, it's a little bit too long for you, but there's not tension. It just, uh, it feels, there's nothing like bamboo. If you don't have bamboo in your closet, our bamboo specifically, um, treat yourself. I know it's expensive. It is very expensive to make. It's a luxury material, but I can tell you this. I wear bamboo every day. It's the last thing I put on, last thing I take off during the day, and last thing I put on. It has to stay on my body all the time. In fact, even my cat is now obsessed with the bamboo in our house because she just wants to, our little kitten wants to snuggle up on it all the time. So stay in your normal size. Sleeve is great. Don't size up or size down because of um, the sleeve. You don't need to, but navy is the only color coming back in this. 
um, in the style. So if you're a Grandpa Cardi bamboo lover, then this color you don't have yet. Um, snag it. Look, you're all saying bamboo's worth every penny. <laughs> okay, I'm not the only one who believes that. Okay, and then really quick, our faux leather leggings. These, you guys, is this the last thing to talk about? Oh, my earrings. <laughs> um, these are, listen, I know there are faux leather leggings out in the world. Hey, Spanx for one. Um, that are very, very expensive, very expensive. I feel like, but don't listen to me. You guys can listen to each other. Um, <clears throat> I feel like these are better than Spanx, and they're way cheaper than Spanx, okay? You get that faux leather look, but you have stretch, and they aren't that tacky, sticky, leather-like material. They aren't that, that feel gross on your body. Trust me. I have tried Amazon ones, I've tried Spanx, I've tried them all, okay? I hate the way that fake leather leggings feel in the body. Um, these are not those. In fact, these melt to your body, like they literally form to your body, but they are soft on the inside and they don't have that tacky, sticky, okay? They don't like, I don't know, I don't know. There's a lot of really wrong faux leather out there in the world. Um, so these are a remake. If you have these from last year, they are the same. We constantly sell out of these. Um, these are the remake. They have the nice kind of yoga waistband, so there's not really any tension. Now, I would say these do form to your body. I would say because of that, they run a little bit big. So if you're between sizes or more narrow in the legs, these are my normal size small. But um, they have really, really good stretch, okay, without feeling like tacky or grippy they're super comfortable in fact i really wish we could make these in like colors that didn't look weird okay because it does have that leathering effect look to it and you can kind of see just the variance in the leathering um which gives that really upgraded look so if you're between sizes like you were before or you know a friend who wants them you might be able to size down they are very comfortable and very stretchy so normal size small on these for me which was also the size I wore but they are forgiving do I have anyone in these no one in these except for me um yes April says they're super super comfortable okay yes Tanya your legs don't stick together like hot legs and leather seats in the summer no they don't and that's what's so great to them they don't have I have a freaking pair of expensive ones that you get this like peel off sound okay they don't. They're, in fact, I really wish we could just make non-leather leggings in non-leather because they truly are fabulous. They, they literally melt and shape to your body. So if you don't have them, look. Okay, Claire says they're amazing. They fit and feel wonderful. Leather leggings usually don't evoke that word, comfortable, but these are comfortable. That's what's weird. You, you would think that leather leggings, and you would feel, if you have the Amazon ones, if you have the very expensive brand ones, they aren't. They're not comfortable. They, they suck you in, they might look good, but they aren't comfortable. Ours really, really feel good on the body and they are very stretchy. So some people for that reason can size down in them, but they will be very, very comfortable in your normal size. Okay. See Heather, seriously, the Heather-like leggings are the bomb. They really are. So if you don't have them yet, now's your chance to get them. We sell a lot of them every year because they're fabulous. They feel so good. They actually feel better than a lot of normal leggings on the body, which is so weird because you wouldn't think that leather effect has that. Okay, uh, last thing, Labor Day sale has started, right? Oh, earrings. no, earrings. Oh, these, rest <laughs> these restocked. We launched these a couple of weeks ago um, and we sold out of them really quickly. Silver, and I have the gold on. Remember I said, um, I'm sweating, you guys. It's nothing new. I love, love having a lightweight, kind of just dangly fashion Earring was super important to me. I do not like heavy. I do not like bulky. I do not wear, I'm like a simple girl when it comes to earrings, but sometimes you just need a little bit of something. These are super lightweight. You don't even know they're on. Silver and gold. These are stocked. Um, Labor Day sale is going on. We have a site, like of so much, so much on the site that is on sale. Um, oh, shoot, is Natalie, is she still here? No, you, do we know if she's a large in the leather leggings? She is. She is. Large. Okay. 
Um, so now through September 6th on the Labor Day sale, none of this new stuff is included in the sale, but we have so much new, we have so much stuff on our site that is included up to 80% off, 20 to 80% off almost everything, plus an additional 20% off sale. And you get a free necklace over orders over 125. So grab one of these cute little, little things because these ones, which should be coming any day. Um, I love stacking this. Isn't that fun? Like a super perfect little stack. Okay, that's it. I kept you guys for a long time. That was a big launch. It's all in. We're hoping shoes, shoes can launch soon. We're hoping more bamboo shows up soon. We're hoping, there's so much. Denim jackets, leather jackets, um, all this stuff we're just waiting for. So, oh, can one of the extra large girls show the leggings on them? Is there anyone that's comfortable back there? We did not have that on anyone else but me. Um, oh, on the leather leggings. Is anyone? Oh, extra large. Oh. Yeah. Amanda, will you do that for us? No, Michelle. <laughs> okay, well, we'll um, I don't want to keep you guys, so ask that over on our VIP page and we'll get we'll get a picture, but they look, what, is that okay? Yeah. Okay. Um, they look fabulous on them. Like Amanda had them on yesterday and they feel good and have great stretch. If you are between um, sizes or more narrow through the legs, you can probably, and waist, you can probably size down, but they're very comfortable in your normal size. Um, Eileen, there is more gold necklace extenders coming on the way. Yes. Um, oh, Karen, ugh, the cuffed waist shapers. Um, there is a major holdup with that boat, container, whatever. Um, I don't even know the stories that are going on right now on that side of the country, but I know it's a big mess with this whole supply chain. So we received only partial shipment. We are still waiting on the rest of those as soon as we get word that they're either on their way finally being unloaded or whatever um, we will listen but we have thousands more of the cuffed thousands more of the cuffed waist shapers um, that we haven't gotten yet and that we just haven't put up for sale on our site because we're waiting to figure out when they're here okay oh oh, oh she did it look at that <laughs> she scrambled michelle put on nor her normal size extra large in the leggings and i'm she would say it too they're comfortable fit right not not tight at the top not nope. not snug like they just they they'll and they just melt to your body once you put them on okay all right <laughs> does that help i'm gonna let you guys go we are gonna have a launch um <clears throat> there's still more on the way <laughs> in transport to us i hope we will probably have a launch next tuesday i know it's another weird day but i'm actually out of town next week and then we have another photo shoot coming up um, so there will probably be a launch Tuesday, maybe when, I think Tuesday next week. Okay. All right. Signing off. Have a great weekend or rest of your week. I didn't have the weekend yet, but this is a good Wednesday. This is a good Wednesday. Good launch day Wednesday. So we'll see you guys later. Bye.